Yes, this virus is spreading. We are now up to five cases in the United States. And yes, more people are dying from it. But how concerned should we actually really be about it? Well, I went to an authority on this here, Dr. John Sinnott. He is the chairman of the College of Internal Medicine at USF and an infectious disease specialist at Tampa General. He has worked on previous outbreaks, including Ebola, SARS, and MERS. But this virus is not nearly as fatal. In fact, he says there is a virus that right now poses a much greater risk to Americans than the coronavirus, and it is far more deadly. I worry a great deal about influenza, a serious systemic illness. Last year in America, 80,000 people died of influenza. 80,000. Yeah, you have a better chance of getting the flu than coronavirus or woo flu, as Dr. Sennett calls it. Take a look at the numbers here. Out of the more than 6,000 cases worldwide of coronavirus, nearly 200 people have died so far, all of them in China. But compare that to this year's flu season, 15 million cases and more than 8,000 deaths. And that is just in the U.S. Coronavirus might be highly contagious, but unless you have been to China, Dr. Sennett says, as it stands now, you are not going to get it. It is that simple. It's new, and what people don't know frightens them. The dangerous killer flu is out there now. So here's the bottom line. The CDC says the coronavirus is not spreading in the U.S. All the cases have been people who went to China. And while it is a serious illness, you're much more likely to get the flu. And this year's flu season hasn't peaked yet.